Last time on Total Drama Island, the competitors were forced to conquer their deepest, darkest fears. Not all of them succeeded, but others surprised the group and faced their fears head on. In a shocking twist, Tyler let the bass down when he was too chicken to face the chicken. Get it? <laughs> and it was bye bye Tyler. Once again, the bass find themselves behind. Can they pull this one out of the water? Find out today on Total Drama Island. The mom and dad, I'm doing fine. You guys are on my mind. You asked me what I wanted to be, and now I think the answer is plain to see. Today's challenge is a true summer camp experience, a canoe trip. You'll be paddling your canoes across the lake to Boney Island. When you get there, you must portage your canoes to the other side of the island, which is about a two hour hike through treacherous, dense jungle. We've got to pour what? Portage. Dude, walk with your canoe. Oh. When you arrive at the other end of the island, you'll build a rescue fire that will be judged by me. The first team to paddle home and return their canoes to the beach is the winner of invincibility. Move, campers, move! Oh, wait, one more thing I should mention. Legend has it, if you take anything off the island, you'll be cursed forever. Yeah! <laughs> a cursed island! Whoa! Now, get in your canoes and let's have some fun! Yes! What'd I miss? Canoes. Chris told us to pick a paddle partner. It was time for me to make my move. If I could just get Gwen alone for five minutes, I knew I could woo her with my manly charms. Gwen, you and me, open water. What do you say? Gwen, you have to come with us. <sighs> Fine, but I'm in charge. That's the way I like it. Yes, 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 it is so on. Cody? He's like an annoying brother. A really annoying little brother. So much for hooking up with Trent. Just follow my technique. I'm 187th Cherokee, you know? Which means, like, the tribe could totally, like, claim me at any time. Let's hope it's today. Courtney, be my partner? Man, I thought Bridge and I were tied, but suddenly, I don't know, it's like she's fading on me. Nah, it's all good. Hey, Jeff, need a partner? Excellent! Yo, man, the canoes flip over a lot. No, you're thinking kayaks. Unless we hit some rough water. Water can get 
Rough? Oh yeah, sometimes it can get totally radical out there. When I was eight, my brothers dared me to jump off the high dive platform at the pool. I was scared, but I jumped. I wasn't gonna let them call me chicken. I landed on my butt. Sounds better than a belly flop, right? Wrong. My trunks went so far up my butt, I had to go to the hospital to get them removed. They invented a new word for what I did, the wedgie flop. I've been afraid of water ever since. Woohoo! It's okay. I've got it. Do you want my help? No, no. We're gonna be fine. If this canoe's a rockin', don't come a knockin'. <laughs> Ow, that's smart! On your marks, get set, paddle! That's gonna provoke some angry emails. So, you want to go out sometime? No. How about Friday night? Uh, no. Saturday's good for me. How about Saturday? I'm not going out with you. Ever. Okay, fine. Sheesh. So, is Sunday out of the question? Uh, got it. Okay. Maybe she wasn't quite ready for the Codemeister. And then these Bushmen taught us how to properly catch and cook crocodile, as well as koala. Uh, isn't killing a koala bear illegal? Oh, I don't know. Probably, yeah. <laughs> probably it's illegal. You don't mind if I work on my tan, do you? I don't mind one bit. Can I ask you something, dude? I gave Bridget an awesome gift this morning, but she's been sending me some weird vibes. Oh my gosh, Courtney, it was so bad. I come back from brushing my teeth, and I notice something bulging under my covers. When I lifted them, there it was. <gasps> no! Yes! I made it in arts and crafts. No, you didn't. I did. It gets worse. Etched into the back was an inscription that said, I hope you think of me whenever you drop loose change into this. Not good? Dang, dude. That is so bad, you need a new word for how bad that is. See, dating's like feeding a bunny. You want the bunny to come to you so you don't make any sudden moves. Here, bunny, bunny, bunny. You drop a heart-shaped, handmade clay bowl on a bunny, and the bunny's gonna run, man. You feeling me? So I messed up. You messed up, dude. I think I know why you keep shooting me down. It's because of Trent, isn't it? Look, I'm pretty tight with Trent. And I was definitely sensing an I'm into Gwen vibe from him. I'll put in a good word for you, you know, if you want. Wow, that's really cool of you. Yeah, well. If you can get us in the same boat on the way home, I'll so owe you one. Interesting that you would say that. See, I'm in a bit of trouble myself. What do you mean? Well. I kind of bet Owen that if I got your bra, he'd do all my dishes for the rest of the competition. <laughs> oh! <laughs> right. Asking too much. Got it. Hey, was that there earlier? I don't think so. You'll be paddling your canoes across the lake? To Boney Island. Okay, did you see that skull? How cool is that? It's like this place is haunted or something. Let's just get this over with. Oh, 
monster beavers! A remnant of the Pleistocene era, the woolly beaver is a day-active rodent indigenous to Boney Island. Oh yeah, and they're meat eaters. They're leaving. Did anybody pack a change of underwear? <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. <laughs> oh, oh, it is. oh, man. I am definitely going to need new underwear. Someone do something. Oh, wait. Look. Where did that come from? I was gonna make us a romantic picnic. With bread from your pants? Just throw it already. It worked! Come on, the race isn't over yet. We still have to burn stuff. Which way are we gonna go? Left. Definitely left. I don't know. I think we should take the one on the right. The right trail is wider. What are you looking at? <sighs> I can see the other team. They're taking the path on the right. Then let's go left. Guys, uh, don't want to panic here, but I'm shrinking. Right. How am I supposed to know what quicksand looks like? It looks just like sand. <laughs> Can you believe they fell for that? <laughs> I set it up, but I didn't think anyone would walk into it. <laughs> That's just great. <laughs> Uh-oh. No, don't! Oh. I'm stuck too! I so didn't see that coming. Help! Somebody help us! Whoa. Hey, thanks, bro. You're a lifesaver. I am? My hero. Where did you learn to do that? You know, I watch a lot of movies. This is very touching, guys, but we've still got a challenge to win. Just when things were looking up for the bass, Ooh. disaster struck. Oh, my leg! <gasps> I'm down! I'm down! Oh, it's so unfair! Why did this have to happen now? Why? Why? Jeff! You've got to go on without me. Oh, uh, We're not leaving any man behind. Not on my watch. I didn't know if I was going to make it. It was touch and go. I've seen surfers get eaten by sharks before, but this? This was horrifying. The man just kept going. Dude's got heart. do that so quickly. No rule against carrying lighters. Edge, killer bass. If you take anything off the island, you'll be cursed forever. What'd I miss? Canoes. Thanks for saving my butt, man. Just looking out for a fellow gopher. Want to sip? 
No, I'm good. Trent, let's talk. Mono a mono. Okay. What do you want to talk about? Gwen. See, I hit on her, but I struck out a, a few times. The point is, she's not into me. She's into you. If you're lying, I could easily rearrange your face. You know that, right? Dude, buddy! What do I have to gain from lying to you? Okay. So what do you think I should do about it? Well, I'll tell you, Trent. Here's how I'd play it. Ladies, are you almost finished with your tea party? We're in the middle of a challenge here. Bridget, you've got first aid training, right? Maybe you could check out Jeff's wounds. You might have gangrene. Or jungle rot. Or athlete's foot. I owe Jeff big time. He helped me get over my fear of water. So when I saw him drowning with the ladies, I had to help the dude out. I don't think this is going to be big enough. You heard the woman. We need more wood, guys. Come on, let's go. How are we supposed to get home now? This ought to do the trick. It's a handmade fire starter I made from some tree sap and sand. Stand back, guys. This is gonna be big. Do that. Oh, you know, I spent a summer training with the reserves. Yeah, I got into some trouble there and like blew up the kitchen by accident, <laughs> which is why the RCMP is like still all over my butt. <laughs> I am so totally AWOL. Guys, since you're both a bit shaken by the whole quicksand thing, we should split you up. How about I go with Lindsay and Beth, and Wen can paddle back with Trent? Sounds cool. What are we gonna do without paddles? You guys could get someone to swim behind the boats and push them. I did that once for this huge, like, 60-foot yacht. The whole crew had to flutter kick for, like, eight days to get to shore. And, like, four of us got eaten by sharks. <laughs> I didn't, <laughs> not me. But it was really insane. Okay, later. That might work. We need someone big enough to push all the canoes back. DJ, you're the only one who's strong enough. You can't ask him to do that. The dude can't swim. Jeff, I know you're friends, but DJ's the only chance we've got. She's right. Those skinny arms aren't going to cut it. I'll do it. You can't swim with that kind of injury. You're horribly disfigured. I can do this. I have to. It was all up to me. I needed to swim like a killer bass should, and no wedgie flop was going to stand in my way. That is one brave man. DJ! 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 The bass are the winners! Yay! You cost us the game! You are dead! Right. Okay, you are so lucky that my license to kill is currently expired. And now, the always anxiety-inducing marshmallow ceremony. When I call your name, come and get a marshmallow. Beth? Trent? Gwen. Cody. Owen. Heather. Lashana. One last marshmallow. The person who doesn't get this marshmallow will walk off the dock of shame and take a ride on the boat of losers. Who's it gonna be? Is 
that means enjoy dish duty my good man you mean it belongs to a gentleman never kisses and tells <sighs> have any glue <laughs> I wouldn't waste my time trying to fix that maybe I would 